I have not voted already, and that's why I'm honestly very, very anxious to vote. First time voters are looking to have their voices heard during this election. They'll be heading to the ballot box to cast their vote on October 3rd. New voters say the environment, social justice issues, and inflation are at the top of their priorities. They'll be taking to the polls. If I can narrow it down to two priorities, it would be, of course, the environment is the first one. It's always going to be my first priority because I think it's a problem that we all deal with collectively and we're all facing collectively in disproportionate ways, of course. And another priority I have is the housing crisis as well. Sometimes I go grocery shopping for my parents and I see the outrageous prices. Like, for a thing of sliced meat, it's like almost $10, okay? And everything is just going up, 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 up. And I feel like the concern for companies or the government is profit and it's not the people. My priorities are the immigration, the inflation and climate change. What really concerns me the most is really about uh, the question of the direction in which Quebec as a society is heading. And as a Quebecer, and as a son of two immigrants who immigrated to Canada and to Quebec, as it's really, I'm concerned about the decisions and the policies that are in place. Some students are expressing a feeling of demoralization at the way in which um, minority communities and immigrant communities have kind of been weaponized and maybe even scapegoated um, over the course of this uh, election campaign. Something else that's incredibly important to students um, is climate change, a just transition away from fossil fuel and doing so in a way that is um, respectful to indigenous sovereignty and land rights. But unfortunately, the statistic is that only 50% of my generation is actually going to vote, probably. So there's a huge involvement, there's a will, but I think as a whole, we're very discouraged considering the options. It gives them a flavor of what many Canadians have to experience every two or four years or so, which is the dreaded strategic voting choice. And many students feel as though they don't have a perfect option and they have to settle for some type of hold your nose and uh, grit your teeth and settle for a second or even third best. In Montreal, Brittany Enriquez, City News.